So, how are you? Were you scared? No. Well, kind of. Yeah. When I didn't know where you were. Then Dad told me that you were here at his house. And I was happy. Oh, I'm so happy, too, because I missed you so, so much. I missed you, too, Mom. Yeah. So are you going to be able to keep it a secret? Not going to tell anyone that I'm here? I won't tell anyone. I don't want to wreck this. You and Dad are finally together. That's all I ever wanted. You know, Star, um... Your daddy and I aren't, you know, together as a couple. Again, you know that, right? Well, it's kind of like that. Which is cool, anyway. Hey, hey, where are you going? Homework. Uh, I'm gonna go check on Jen at the hospital. Okay, well, I hope she's okay. Yeah, me too. Todd? What? Could you give us some privacy, please? It's, um, it's been a long time since I've been here. And I count my blessings every day. Nothing's changed. And I guess since I have to hide here until we're safe from the shooter, it's nice to have the comforts of home. Well, if you're looking for, like, little candies or bottles of shampoo or stuff, there's none of that stuff here. Thank you for moving out of your bedroom for me. I'm not moving anywhere. I I'm not staying in this room with you, Todd. You don't have a choice. What do you mean I don't have a choice? You have six rooms in this penthouse. Yeah, but this is the safest room in the penthouse. Look, I got the, the windows shut with the... the... Well, the shades are drawn, and, and look, I'm the only one who ever comes in here. And if somebody ever does come in here and sees you, you can, you know, just hop in the closet there, because it's got a false back, and you can hide in, until they they won't find you. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, I will stay here. And you can stay in the guest bedroom. All right, yeah, that, that's a great idea. And what's wrong with that idea, on, Todd? Buddy, you know, people, nobody would be suspicious of me staying in a guest room of my own house, especially when nobody's supposed to be staying here in my bedroom. Okay, fine. Then I will stay in the guest bedroom. No, you, you I, come on. I mean, then the, the maid will come and, and uh, you know, see that the bed has been slept in and tell everybody all about it. Well, come on, that's what they do. Yeah, right. And since when do you have a maid, Todd? Well, there's Hetty and... and as anybody. Look, it's, you're just gonna have to trust me. This is really... You want me to, to trust you? Yeah. Oh, please. This is never gonna work. Why not? Because it's not. And I'm gonna call Sam right now and tell him he has to find me a new place to live. Well, I thought you wanted to be close to the kids. That's a stupid idea. I mean, how could, how could he think that you and I could share a bedroom? You and Dad are sharing a bedroom? You're back together! Jen. Star, um... You know, we've talked about this. See, your daddy and I, we are not, not a couple. We're just living here together, but not as husband and wife. Now, you understand that, don't you? I know you said that. Yeah, and that is exactly what I meant. That's what you said last time, and then you ended up getting married. Oh, well, that's not going to happen this time, Star, okay? Okay, look, Star, it's just, it's not what you think. I mean, even though your mother and I are going to be sharing a bedroom, we're going to have separate beds. And how long are we going to live together? I don't know. It depends. On what? Th that, uh, it depends on a, on a lot of, of things, Star. And you know what? 
Young lady, I think it's time that you hit the sack. No. Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. I love you, Mommy. Good night. I love you too, beautiful. Good night, Daddy. Good night, Star. Good night. Good night. See? See what? Well, this is, you know, the perfect place for you to hide. You know, Todd, the only thing perfect about it is that I get to see my children. Well, and also nobody would ever think to look for you here, and, and, and nobody can see you while you're here. And if somebody does show up, you can always just, you know, hide in the, in the, in the magic wardrobe over there. So what's this you were saying about, um, separate beds? Oh, right. Hey, never let it be said I'm not a great host. I got your bed. Well, that's very, very nice of you. Oh! What are you looking at? Start blowing. Uh. Boy, will you quit moving around? Your bed's all squeaky. Well, you couldn't blow it up? I don't know how enough hot air you think you'd use it. Okay, fine, but tomorrow night you're sleeping on the floor. You're having a bad dream. No, Todd. Take a deep breath. No. Look at you. Are you even awake? He was right here. No, there was nobody here. Look was... around. There's anybody. There's he, nobody here. It was here. very it's real. He was standing right there looking down at me. I'll never you forget his stop. face. Todd, and, and he fine. had a gun. He, the gun was right there. Nobody's going to hurt you. Oh. Sit down. He was, he was there. His eyes. My God, he wants me dead. He wants me dead. Well, he'll have to go through me first. Why can't I just forget that night? I just keep... Seeing it, I see him. He was standing there with, with the gun in his hand, and I swear if he hadn't heard those sirens. Well, he, he did hear those sirens, me. and you got away because you're smart and, and you're tough, Blair. No, Todd. I'm lucky, is what I am. Call it whatever you want. There is no way that guy is ever going to find you here. How do you know that? He said that he was going to come back, and he meant it. I heard him. You weren't even there. Nobody's gonna find you here. This is the perfect hiding oh, place. Yeah, right, and you keep saying that, Because don't you? everybody knows you can't stand me. That's what the, this whole plan is about. It's genius. I'm a genius. Ah, okay. See? Look at you. Feeling better already, huh? I am, actually. How to knock? Oh, were you born in a barn? Sam, I'm so glad that you're here. Well, that makes one of us. Am I interrupting something? I was having a, a really terrible nightmare. Man, she screamed so much, it gave me a nightmare. And Todd was trying to make me feel better. Did it work? Yeah, I, 
I guess. But you know, now that you're here, Sam. You spare me. Um, Todd slept in the bed. <laughs> you made Blair sleep on the floor? Well, I got her an air mattress. So why didn't you sleep in it? 